tucked away in the scenic foothills of the Appalachian Mountains, covering nearly 5,000 acres of pristine nature in northwest Georgia, stands one of the most technologically advanced electric generation plants in the country, Rocky Mountain Pump Storage Hydroelectric Plant. A clean and renewable energy source, Rocky Mountain uses the power of water to generate electricity for 38 Georgia Electric Membership Corporations, or EMCs, and the millions of people they serve. Oglethorpe Power Corporation, one of the nation's largest power supply cooperatives, owns 75% of the Rocky Mountain plant, while Georgia Power maintains a 25% share. Pumped storage plants like Rocky Mountain provide critical regulation of the power system to meet the constantly changing electrical demand. As a peaking power facility, Rocky Mountain provides electricity whenever it is needed to meet the growing demand for power. Peak demand occurs during cold winter mornings and late evenings, and in hot summer afternoons when air conditioning causes electricity usage to reach its highest levels. Generating electricity begins at the upper reservoir, where millions of gallons of falling water produce energy by spinning giant turbines. Each rotating turbine then spins the shaft of a generator, creating an electric current. The upper reservoir covers more than 200 acres. The intake structure or drain measures 24 feet high and 140 feet wide and leads to a shaft before dropping over 700 feet straight down through the mountain. The level of water stored in the reservoir can drop as much as 51 feet as it flows from the shaft to a horizontal tunnel that is 35 feet wide and nearly eight football fields in length. The tunnel splits into three penstocks, which leads to the turbines located inside the plant. The powerhouse stands 16 stories high, with 13 stories situated below water level. This mammoth structure contains three gigantic pump turbines, along with motor generators and power transformers. In fact, there is enough steel in the plant to fill 268 rail cars, nearly 2 million pounds. The control room at Rocky Mountain utilizes some of the most innovative technology to operate the plant's powerful process of creating electricity from water. When the demand for electricity increases, the order is sent from the control system operator to the Rocky Mountain control room operator to start a unit. The generation process begins with the opening of the inlet valve and wicket gates. This allows the water from the upper reservoir to flow through and rotate the turbine. When the rotation of the turbine reaches a speed of 225 revolutions per minute, the unit breaker closes and the generator sends electricity to transmission lines and throughout the system. The plant is capable of generating more than 1,000 megawatts of electric energy. It takes about three minutes to complete the entire starting process. Nearly 60,000 gallons can pass through each turbine every second, producing more than 500,000 horsepower. Once the water from the upper reservoir drives the turbines, it empties into the 600-acre lower reservoir, which can fluctuate as much as 20 feet. The water flow in and out of the lakes is balanced by a series of eight dams. The main dam is 120 feet high and 900 feet long. The water is 60 feet deep. While most hydroelectric plants make use of continually falling water, a pumped storage plant reuses the same water, making this type of power facility both cost-effective and a source of renewable energy. At night, the millions of gallons of water used to generate electricity during the day are pumped back up the mountain to the upper reservoir, where the water is recycled for use the next day. The turbine's rotation is reversed, and they now become giant pumps, each one capable of moving over 6,000 cubic feet of water per second from the lower reservoir to the upper reservoir. By refilling the upper reservoir during the low demand for electricity, Rocky Mountain is able to use excess electricity available from other plants. 
It takes only about seven hours for the pumps to refill the upper reservoir. Pumped storage is the largest capacity form of grid energy storage now available. Plants such as Rocky Mountain help keep other power plants more efficient and provide reserve generation when needed the most. The area surrounding the plant property is an exceptional place to experience the great outdoors. Rocky Mountain Recreational Area is rich in wildlife, with two lakes covering 600 acres, providing excellent fishing, swimming, and camping where you can bring a recreational vehicle or pitch a tent. For Oglethorpe Power, the Rocky Mountain plant was seven years and $550 million in the making. Today, this environmentally friendly plant serves millions of consumers, keeping the electricity on no matter what the demand and supplying Georgia's energy needs now and into the future.